It's a great day with that dark stuff filling up my favorite cup. How you call feeling? How you call feeling? How you call feeling now? Yeah. Howdy, partner. Well, if you've got an early morning out there in the prairie or on your farm, you might want a good cup of coffee and so for whatever reason I've decided to pick up Yellowstone Ranch House Dark Roast uh, okay so this is clearly a uh, coffee made in honor of the television show Yellowstone I've never watched this show not that I'm not interested in it it's just there's 80 million TV shows now and I just don't watch that many of them haven't had enough time and it's had a few seasons, so it seems very exhausting to just try to catch up. Nevertheless, clearly a popular show, and as a result, they've branded themselves into the coffee business. I don't know, maybe some other businesses too. I have no idea. I've not watched this show. Is coffee integral to the character's circumstances? Maybe. I don't know. Do I look like I need a cup of coffee? Beth. So I assume this is... Beth from Yellowstone does look, does ask this question. Is this like, did I do that? Which Urkel would say on Family Matters. I don't know. I don't watch this show. So this is Ranch House Dark Roast. I'm assuming there's ranch houses in the show. The description from the back, start every day the Dutton way. Okay, clearly the Dutton Ranch is from Yellowstone. We're all learning something right now if we're not fans of it. Life on the Dutton Ranch requires a fistful of grit and the spirit of a cowboy. Whether you're watching Daybreak over Montana's big sky, defending what's worth protecting, <laughs> or just headed to the rodeo, that's my plan for today. This bold and smooth blend is your go-to for riding out everyday adventures and all of life's ups and downs. Okay, I love this, and Paramount Network, as it would be, as they hold production ownership of the show. It's just hilarious. <laughs> All this, uh, there's literally no description of the coffee. <laughs> it's just, hey, you love this show? We're going to make a ton of references, and then you'll drink this coffee, right? You don't care. You love Yellowstone. And sure, that is what drew me to this. So again, this was priced at $8.99 at the grocery store. So it's in that mid-tier pricing of uh, coffee that's out there. Uh, not surprisingly, there is no there's fair trade, nothing. It, it's Yellowstone, baby. So this is distributed by Food Story Curations in Phoenix. I don't know what that is. A lot of question marks about the ranch house. So let's enter the ranch house and see uh, how we feel. Okay, so here is a circumstance I was in. As you've seen from previous recent How You Call Feelings, I've been drinking a lot of lighter roasts, medium roasts, and I just wanted to pick up a quick dark roast from the store, and I go, hey, I've never tried a coffee that's been branded by a television show. So that's where I basically said, let's give this Yellowstone a try. From a standpoint of dark roasts, you know, honestly, just tasting this, It's probably, I, you know, I haven't had a, one of those Folgers Dark Roast, whatever it's called, in a while. But this is like a little bit in that realm or perhaps a tear up. It's not surprising it would taste this way, given the vibe of uh, Yellowstone and that really you're buying a bag of coffee based on your love of a TV show. Which personally I don't create, I don't do reviews of coffee because I'm like, whoa, cool. Here's a uh, Matlock coffee, can't wait to drink it because I love Matlock. So, uh, honestly, I've reviewed other dark roasts on um, the this show and there are so many better I can think of. Uh, San Francisco Bay, that's available at Costco. 
that is just a dark roast with a lot more flavor than this and at a cheaper price point when you're buying it in bulk. So really let's accept what the ranch house is all about. Over at the Duttons, all they care about is uh, making a few more bucks off your love of a TV show. Will that all go to Kevin Costner's pocket? I have no idea. I assume he's an executive producer of the show. So yeah, Beth, whomever she is, I guess Mrs. Dutton, right? God, I'm gay. My allergies are somehow kicking in too, and then I didn't bring any Kleenex, so I apologize for being particularly disgusting with snot in my hands. But hey, we're drinking Yellowstone out on the ranch. There is no Kleenex. So, to get through every day's ups and downs, to feel like Mrs. Beth Dutton, again, I'm assuming a lot about this show, uh, just based off a coffee bag. But, yeah, to answer the question, how you call feeling? Uh, uh, I think I prefer Colombo coffee, thanks. How you call feeling?